The master's faculty, both within the Office of Diversity, Equity, and Inclusion and beyond, played a huge role in making this year's Martin Luther King Jr. Remembrance Day particularly special. This year, Masters' programming featured a keynote speaker who serves as the Associate Professor of African American Studies at Princeton University, Dr. Ruha Benjamin, who spoke to the school on the issue of race in relation to technology. Dr. Benjamin talked about current issues plaguing our world, learning from our past and looking forward, as well as expanding on the day's message. Not done. We're not done. This work is not done. Afterwards, students enjoyed some donuts and hot chocolate in the cafe provided by the school before they gathered for reflection and discussion in their advisory groups and watched a film titled Race to be Human. The afternoon featured a special lunch from Brock, as well as specific workshops developed over time with the help of faculty leaders and outside organizations that Masters brought in. Dr. Rollins Davis, head of Diversity, Equity, and Inclusion program at Masters, explained the importance of MLK Day to him. What does uh, Martin Luther King as a figure mean to you? Oh boy, that's a big question. Uh, he means everything to me, um, in no small part because I have a direct family connection to Dr. King. Uh, my father knew Dr. King, not well, but knew him enough, uh, well enough to be invited to his house on, on several occasions, and so I grew up hearing stories about Dr. King. Uh, so this day is incredibly important to me. We really don't know as much as we think we know about Dr. King, his work, the legacy. Um, I think a lot of it has been lost over the years, and MLK Day has been relegated to just a day off. And in my view, it, it should not be a day off. And this is not my, t my phrase, somebody uttered this years ago, but uh, instead of it being a day off, it should be a day on. And I take that to heart, and I really want the master's community to engage with the life and legacy of Dr. King. And my hope is that this day becomes really important to students at Masters because they need to learn something, they recognize they need to learn something, and they willingly embrace the opportunity. Davis also shouted out several faculty members who aided him throughout the day. Ms. Barrell is helping to coordinate some of the performance aspects of the day that'll happen towards the end um, with the performance by the dance group Muse. Um, Mr. Ebersol uh, created the program, which was absolutely beautiful this year, um, and uh, obviously Mr. Douglas had a, a huge hand in coordinating everything uh, in terms of both the, the programs for the day um, to the, the menu of what's being served in the dining hall, so there was quite a bit of, of uh, faculty involvement. The dining hall's special menu was no small feat this year. Douglas worked with the team at Brock to create a special menu of culturally important foods, as well as putting educational signs throughout the dining hall. Student workshop leaders appreciated the guidance they received from master's faculty in designing their programs. Beyond the assistance they provided to students in designing their workshops, faculty helped create their own and partnered with outside organizations. Upper school Spanish teacher Roberto Mercedes partnered with the Poor People's Campaign to bring attention to the work they've been accomplishing and strive to do. All in all, planning and leading this year's MLK Day took a village to accomplish, but ended up being a moment to remember. Xavier Ralston, TBN, The Master's School.